somewhere. Don't be surprised if y'all don't see him on CNN. Fox, amen. Channel 12. Lord, have mercy, God. Let it flow. My Jesus, when nobody else don't want it to flow. Give the Lord a hand clap in Saving that White House to be saved. Yes. 
Those are not saving our house, Lord. Save them, Lord, to the marrow that's born in for Call our seed in, Lord. Yes, Lord. We're asking out of the north, south, east, and west, Lord. Out of the four corners of the winds, Lord. Yes. Of this hurt, Lord. In Jesus' name, we ask, oh God. Yes. And God, we'll thank you for it. We pray for that backslider, that southern man, that woman, that child, that woman the street. No place to go, Lord. Give them a mind that want to be saved. In a mind that want to stay saved, a place to live. Yes, in Jesus' name, we ask, oh God. And God will thank you for that, Lord. Amen. We pray for Israel. There'll be peace in Israel, Lord. You say we bless Israel. You bless us, Lord. We bless Israel with the fruit of our lips, Lord. We bless the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit, and the Word of God. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Lord, have mercy. Hallelujah. Those that are sick in their bodies, Lord. Yes. Best prayer for Brother Curtis Johnson. Touch his body, Lord. Right now. We pray, God, you raise them back up for your honor and your glory. Yes, Lord. And bind any hearing spirit of the demon and the devil try to take him out of here. Yes, let it be bound in heaven, Lord. And let your power flow through his body, Lord. You're to raise them up before you can do it again. Yes, in Jesus' name. Yes, and everybody say, Amen. Amen. Give the Lord a hand clap for you. Thank God man, for who he is. Great. Well, today is Easter. Uh-huh. Uh, that's why I look like that. I'm an ambassador for the king. I serve the Lord. Amen. I'm an ambassador. Uh, some people, uh, as, John, as Paul said in his writing, some they take one day and esteem above the other. Yeah. And some take every day a lot. Well, I'm the one that takes every day a lot. Every day? So if you're going to celebrate the resurrection on this day, I'm going to be in that witch. Yeah. Y'all going to leave me out? What'd you say? I'm coming with you. And then after Easter, I will celebrate this celebration Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Sunday, and back Sunday again. Mm -hmm. uh, I take every day a lot. Every day. And then if y'all just pick out one day, I'm going to go in there with you. It's all today. All right. All right, what I had to do, I got this, of course, uh, 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 from Google. I got this from Google on the uh, celebration of Easter Sunday. Here's what Google said about it now. Some people Google uh, Easter and they find the smooth stuff. I Google Easter to find the truth. There you go. What the truth That's do? That's the difference, huh? What the truth do? Uh, that you go free. All right. From the bunny rabbit. <laughs> the celebration of Easter Sunday is held as the most important religious holiday of what claims to be Christianity. Yet the holiday does have an origin from the teaching of Christ and his apostles, or anyone else. Lord, have mercy, God. The word Easter, the English word for Easter, uh, is Ash Ashtar, I-S-H-T-A-R. It's found only once in the King James Version in the Bible. And we're going we're gonna to start, and we're going to show you in the King James, yeah. you do have Easter in the King James. But what does that word mean, Easter? Okay, we'll find that out too. Amen. In the King James Version. Okay, you find that in Acts 12 and 4. That's what we're going to go to. That's what we're going to start off at. And that is what intentionally uh, mislaid from the Greek word pascha, P-A-S-C-H-A, which is reality should have been Passover. Yeah. That's what Easter actually means, Passover, yeah. in the King James Version. And you're going to see it in the footnote. That's what it means. Give the Lord a hand clap for the master being out here. This guy's brother. Amen. Good to see you, brother. It was, it was correctly translated. Right now we're just reading, amen, from uh, 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 Google uh, on, 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 on Easter. It, uh, a lot of people don't deal with the history. But if any of you follow this, we deal with the history side, then we go into the world. Uh, this is the history of it. It was correctly translated Passover in the 28th. 28 other locations in King James, New Testament, uh, Easter was not celebrated as a so-called Christian holiday until after the Catholic Nicholas Council was uh, convicted in. So he won't go to the end. Nice. Easter was before the death of Jesus. The word is nice season. Huh? Yeah. Nice season. Thank you, brother uh, Charles. That's N I C E N E. Thank you, sir. Amen. Nicene. Amen. If y'all see any other words I mispronounced, y'all hit me with it. Amen. Number, okay. Prior to that time and until today, the holiday by the name was and is a pagan holiday. 
This holiday was celebrated for thousands of years before the birth of Jesus Christ. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I didn't know that. Did. That was before Jesus Christ's birth. But they, it's a pagan religion. They introduced it into Christianity. They brought it in. To deceive. To what? To deceive. You heard Brother Joe? He owned it. Brother It's going to sound like he cut no corners this morning. Mm -hmm. To deceive you. But guess what? We ain't going to be deceived by the bunny rabbit today. <laughs> Uh, and that makes sense to me. You're going to get the butt around his foot for good love, and he lost the foot. Mm -hmm. He had four of them. Uh -huh. He had four of them. And he had four of them. Now he got the how? With three. Uh, y'all think I'm with, uh, uh, he lost the foot, and y'all going to keep him for good? Y'all will? Not me. I'm going to again. Lord, I'm going to do good. Let me tell y'all got a shot today. Uh, so, uh, Lord, have mercy God. Uh, years before Christ, uh, Jesus was well, the religious celebration to uh, the pagan. Now notice, uh, when you Google this, you're going to find out how they start, how they was doing Easter before uh, Jesus Christ's resurrection right. with the bunny rabbit. Right. Now, when you put the bunny rabbit in, it's a pagan queen of heaven. That's what, that's what they celebrate. They celebrate, the, and, and, and it is called the mother of life. Now, you got number two here now. Uh, this, this is what the pagans do. Uh, they did that before Jesus Christ, uh, dead and resurrection. Uh, the, the goodness, Eshtar, G-O-D-D-E-S-S. -S. Goddess. Goddess, thank you. Appreciate it. Eshtar, it's I-S-H-T-A-R. Eshtar. Eshtar, thank you. The goddess of fertility. I, I thought rabbit. He, he, That's he, why they rabbit. This is a lot of bunnies. Yeah, he's a bunny bear. We don't do no bunny rabbit over here. I'm gonna let y'all know. Every fifty dollars in, if no no Easter eggs hung there for the children because it's against God. Mm -hmm. I don't do no Easter egg hunt. See, I'm, I'm straight to going out to God now. If anybody asks you whose side I'm on, tell them what to be. That I'm on the Lord's side. And if you're on the Lord's side, I'll be on your side. But if you're not. Jesus Christ was crucified at the exit time, at the exact time the Passover lamb was being slaughtered. Amen. For the Passover meal on the day preceding the first day of the feast of unleavened bread. Now he's he getting in the, in the biblical part here now. Okay. Amen. Uh, the fourth day of the week before sundown. After uh, sundown, uh, they were at the Passover meal. Uh, Lord have a the day and the first day of the feast of unleavened bread, a high day, a special holiday, Sabbath, the fifth day of the week, he resurrected on the third day of the feast of unleavened bread, on the seventh day, uh, Sabbath before sundown. Lord have a they give you some biblical uh, information what happened here. Uh, uh, thus was a grave, the heart of the earth, three days and three nights. Is he in the grave now? Nope. I guarantee you, you go to his grave, you ain't going to find him there. You ain't going to find him in there. He's gone. Mm -hmm. Now, I, I don't understand that. I, why would I want to uh, serve uh, 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 Muhammad and he's still in the grave? He's still in the grave. Now, he's a prophet too. Jesus Christ also called a prophet. He's called, he called a prophet. He called the king. Amen. He's called the high priest. He called the shepherd. He's called the bishop. Lord of Lords, King of Kings. Y'all think I know somebody? I know all the above. And he had predicted, amen, uh, uh, to his disciples, amen, bless God. Uh, Christ and his fathers kept the Passover and the feast of unleavened bread. It did not in any way keep the pagan holiday of Easter. <laughs> I hope y'all caught that one. Right. The disciples never did follow the pagan part of it. That's the bunny rabbit. Right. They were worshiping the god of fertility. Yeah, that's the bunny rabbit. They didn't follow that part. Hey. The church, they didn't introduce it to the church and look good. Children having fun. Yeah. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to give children some fun without doing something wrong. There you go. There you go. Christ followers were forbidden to keep my pagan customer. It says Christ our followers were forbidden, it was forbidden to keep any, how I many? Any. any pagan cousin of pagan.
pagan traditions. So you have to do a research on holidays. Find out where Santa Claus, how you got in there. That's a pagan religion. Of course, God, you get gifts. Give blinded eyes of the wife. You give me a gift, I'm going to thank you, but I ain't buying you nothing, so don't give me nothing for Christmas. Oh, no, you, you got to go somewhere else, Donald. <laughs> they got a lot of church now in Easter, yeah. right? but Donald, you're going to have to go somewhere else. You want some aid? I'll show them Well, you're going to go somewhere else now, Donald. Uh, and you, you, you just raise your finger up and you can be excused. <laughs> raise your what? Raise your finger up. And then you can exit. <laughs> we ain't going to say nothing about when you leave. <laughs> Yeah, anyway, keep the pagan ho holiday of Easter. Christ's followers were forbidden to keep uh, any uh, pagan custom or pagan tradition. These covenant and tradition were de described, amen, to be abomination by God. By who? God. Not by man. A lot of people trying to find out what man say about it. I'm through with man. I don't want to know what you say about it. I want to find out what God said. Amen. Himself through the Old Testament. Look at the, uh, the pagan custom of Easter. Eggs and Easter rabbits are associated with the holiday due to their uh, life-giving reproduction characteristics. Uh, the inferior that the Easter rabbit led, the Easter egg, is a bomber, is a vulnerable lie. Yeah. What is it? Abominable lie. People don't want to tell the truth, you know, and they call it a lie. Yeah. How can they? You know the hair trap, sister. Hey, you know the hair trap, sister. Hey, you know the hair I know the rest of them got to be around there somewhere. Amen. Obama, uh, right now we're just reading out the paper, uh, uh, sister. Amen. And then we're going to get into the word. Obama lie, it has no place in truth. So if you're up there teaching that kind of stuff, you're lying. You're lying. I can't make no claim to that. Let every man be a liar. And what? And let the word of God be true. Amen. So I'm going to do truth. Because yeah. the truth will let me go free. So I can, I can celebrate Easter in my little white suit. Hey, man, when he shows up. Yeah. And I can put my white suit up till next year. <laughs> Unless I decide to wear it in between the years. Yeah. Wear it in hey, the that's time. I can wear it any time. Any time. Get it on another half time for a year. The awesome God. Amen. Hey, that's God. I'm going to have to wait till Easter. Amen. All right, come with me now. Hey, man, to page uh, 1308. That's uh, Acts, the 12th chapter of the fourth book. Hey, the best God, this is another kind of silly God, but I know this guy. I knew y'all were when I saw my sister. I know I just didn't know how many of them was coming. But I know y'all wouldn't, but. The whole pack. Uh huh? The whole pack. The whole, that's what I'm talking about. That's why I like to see the whole, or all of them show up. Hey, Amen. Come in, page 1308, as I, Acts 12 and 4. Acts 12 and 4. Page 1308. When he had apprehended him, he put him in prison. Oh, let's start at the first verse. That's where I started that. I went back and got some more groceries. We're going to do Acts 12, chapter, the first verse, page 1308, so you can know who that is, the apprehended. Now, about the, by the time he heard it, the king stretched forth his hand to vex certain of the church. He killed James, the brother of John, with a sword. And because he saw and pleased the Jews, he proceeded further to take Peter also. So uh, he went along with the people. The yeah. king did. King now he didn't took he didn't took uh, he didn't kill James, the brother of John. He didn't take him out. And the Jews, boy, they all happy about it. So now they got hold of Peter. Said we're gonna get Peter now. He's a he's a leader. He don't want to read his pack. I always saying something. We get him. We lock him up. Says the Jews like that. Stop him. And watch, watch they watch the day when he was on. Take Peter also. Then the days of unleavened bread. We get four drive. And when they had apprehended him, he put him in prison and delivered him to the four quarters of soldiers to keep him, intended after Easter to bring him forth to the people. All right. Look at number two. And if you go to four on on a footnote, twelve and four. You see, it's Passover. That's what he said. Uh -huh. And that's what we dealt with earlier to give you the interpretation of it. Amen. Uh, to bring it down to where. Now, you know the other translation? 
Uh, another tra- all these, uh, a lot of other translations, you ain't going to find East in there. No. The only one you're going to find in King James. The rest of the translation says Passover. They just, they just call it Passover. It would just give me a little bit more knowledge. Because today they call it what? Easter. So you have to have knowledge of what it is. It's Passover. Brother Charles, you tell me. All right, all right, brother y'all. Now I got to tell brother Charles. All right, all right, brother Charles. All right, we get that. That's what he's saying. I'm too bad. We get that. So then, which is the correct? Hold, hold back. So which is the correct naming of the day? Is it the resurrection or is it Easter? Well, you can say either one. Either one. So can I ask oh, one more question? I'm sorry. But then can we say that the Passover was used more in the Old Testament and then when the New Testament You don't find it in the Old Testament. No, no, that's what I mean. No. So, so you just find Passover. Passover. That's what, but we got we're gonna have some scriptures to show you in the Old Testament that it is Passover. And that's what I'm I'm trying to level out here. In the Old Testament, you know, which we know is the history of, of what the Bible is, and then the New Testament is the new uh, New Testament that comes on in. Yeah. Revealed. So, yeah. so what we did, we broke it down in the New Testament to bring it back to the old. Mm-hmm. Okay. That's what we, we just got to read before you got here. Okay, I'm sorry. So we broke we broke it down. <laughs> we broke it down to bring it back to uh, the Old Testament. All right. So you don't find Easter in the New Testament. You only find. I mean, the Old Testament. You just find the New Testament. Then you don't find another translation. I got you, you, you open another translation. That's different from the King James, you ain't going to find an Easter in there. You just find Passover. So in the Old Testament, it's known as the Passover. Yeah. And in the New Testament, it's known as Easter. Just in the King James. In the King James. Yeah. Another translation just say so Passover. it's okay to say Now, today, what they call it? They call it what? Easter. Easter. So we got to get knowledge. See, we're, we're knowledge people over here. Also known as the resurrection of the Lord. Yeah. yeah. We're gonna, and we're going to get in that too, Sister God. Okay. I'll slow down. <laughs> no, slow down. Oh, now, why well, you yeah, tell Sister God? Down. Why you didn't tell Sister God and Brother God to get out your nose? Know? <laughs> because we told Because they understood when I talk to you. Oh. <laughs> mm-hmm. I got to accept that part. <laughs> Everybody show what I've been at, <laughs> We're laughing with you, brother Charles. You are right, man. Don't, you're, you're don't get in your job. feelings, brother. Peter, Peter, we love you. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Don't, don't, don't get in your feelings and emotions, brother. Peter, we love you. We love you, too. Yes, you love you. Yeah, yeah, I bet Peter know y'all love me. Yeah, y'all love you, me too. Thank you, Sister Kim. I know you are. <laughs> get along with that, guys. We're going to get... Yeah, it's awesome. Yeah, it's awesome. We hit, we hit the bottom. We hit the bottom. All right, so let's look at another. Let's look at... Um, let's see what I got here. That's John 1 and 29. That's uh, page 1256. Page 1256. John 1 and 29. John 1 and 29. Page what? Page 1256. Page 1256. John, the first chapter, the 29th verse. The next day John seeth Jesus come unto him and said, Behold, the Lamb of God, which take away the what? Sin of the world. So he's the Lamb of God for the what? The Passover. You had to have a lamb for a Passover. Right? So you had to follow up. He had to follow the pattern of the Old Testament. Amen. So he is that pattern of the Old Testament about the Passover. So he, they called him a Lamb of God. Amen. Because you're going to have to offer this up as a sacrifice. Hallelujah. Lord, how much that? Which take away the sins of the world. This is he whom I said after me coming in man which is preferred before me. For he is before me. This John. And then talking about Jesus. Yeah. I knew him not. But that he should be made manifest to Israel. Therefore am I come baptizing with water. Who's something to baptize with water? God, God did. 
And who ended up baptizing Jesus? John. John did. That's right. yeah, was in the plan. Yeah. Even when he came to John, John said, wait a minute, I'm not worthy for you to sit down and loose your shoes. You come to me? He said, son of the beast, so yeah. that how many righteous? All righteous may be fulfilled. Yeah. So when you fulfill the word of God, you fulfill the righteousness of God. Hallelujah. Is when you don't fulfill his word, you're not fulfilling his righteousness. As a flip side. Yeah. Lord, have mercy. 31 verse, and I knew him not, but he has shed be made manifest to Israel. Therefore I come baptized with the water to the second verse. And John bad rock and sand, I saw the spirit descended from heaven like a dove about upon him. So John, and then saw this, and then he saw, amen, he was a witness to him. Amen. He had to have, see, God always got to have a witness. Amen. He's going to tell you. Amen. What are you going to do? And then you're going to end up being a witness to what happened in your life to tell about what God did. Thank, you. Thank God, somebody. Thank you. I'm a witness. Amen. I'm an ambassador. Yeah. For, for the Lord. All right. The king. Yeah. Ambassador is the one that comes to tell you what the king said. Yeah. I'll come to tell you what the king has said here. All right. Tell it. Amen. Tell it. Oh, Lord, have mercy. I knew him not the third verse. He sent me to baptize with water. The same said unto me upon that whom thou shall see the Spirit descending for every man on him. The same is with baptized with the Holy Ghost. So who baptized the Holy Ghost today? Jesus. Jesus is the one baptized. He uses people. He uses, he uses instruments to work through to baptize people with the Holy Ghost. It ain't that preacher. It ain't the person. It ain't the lady. Watch it, watch it. It's what's in him. And what's in you? Got to come out. It's going to come out of you. Got to come and out. the Lord ordained you to do that. Yeah. Now you're so on. he ordained John the Baptist. Mm -hmm. I wonder I couldn't even get no scribes and Pharisees. They weren't listening. They weren't worthy. Uh, they, well, they didn't believe. They didn't believe. How you going to get somebody that don't believe nothing? John believed. Well, God ain't gonna work through nothing unbelief. Third one, third one, God. And I saw him bear record. Hey Amen. This is the Son of God. Bear record. Again, the next day after John stood and drew the disciples and, and looked upon Jesus, Amen. Walking, he said, "Behold, the Lamb of God." The Passover. Yeah. Here comes the Passover. You see him right there. And the two disciples heard him speak, and they followed Jesus. Lord, how blessed God. Uh, then Jesus turned and saw the Father and said unto them, Why seeketh ye? They said unto him, Rabbi, which is, saying, being interpreted, Master, uh, where dwellest thou? He said unto them, Come and see. They came and saw him, where he dwelt in the boat with him that day, for it was about the ten hour. Lord, help us to God. Get the Lord hands out for you. Amen. He's our Passover. I say, Jesus is a Passover. Yeah. Oh, let me say that here. Cover me down to uh, page eleven forty eight. That's Matthew eleven and two. Page eleven forty eight. Matthew eleven and two. Now, when John had heard in, in, in the prison the words of Christ, he sent unto the disciples. And said to him, Art thou he that, that we should should come, or should we look for another? Now John acted down. He died. He, he didn't. He locked up. Yeah, he's about to lose his head. He said to him, He locked up. He about well, to lose his head. Well, he couldn't go and tell us, John. He had to send him. Yeah. He had to send him to him. Yeah. You're going to find out what's going on here. Wait a minute. Jesus, I'm up there preaching for you. And they got me like, they're talking about cutting my head off. You ain't coming to see about it. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's going to be on today. And said to him, Art thou he that should come unto you? Oh, we need to look for them. So look what Jesus Christ is going to tell him. Look at the fourth verse. Jesus after said to them, Go show John how to win. Again. Again. Go. Again. Again. Go. Sometimes we got to be. Again. Told again. And again. And again. I like you did. Talk to me. Talk to me until I get it right. Mm -hmm. Hey, talk, keep talking to me until I what? Get it right. And right. you got to talk to me again. Talk to me again. So you can get it right. Did I get it wrong? Go tell John again. Again. Those things is now here and see. Let him know I'm the Christ. Yeah. Hey Amen. I'm the one. Mm -hmm. hey, well, Lord, have mercy. Uh, the blind receive what? Oh, go tell John. I'm opening up the blind eyes out here. 
Lord, and, and the lamb was going to tell John, I'm lay, I'm getting my day walking. I said, go tell John again. Amen. The lepers are clean. Go tell John, I'm cleaning up the lepers out there. Yeah. Lord, how I many? And, and, and the dead are, are the, the dead here. Go tell John, the one that couldn't hear nothing. I'm hoping up there he is. Lord, how about say, Is he still doing that today? Yes, sir. He's the same yesterday. Today. today. I said, the Passover is the same. I said, it's 24 7. I said, it's Passover. It's 24 7. You're the lamb. Yes. Even when things go wrong, they say, this too shall pass. <laughs> Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. Lord that's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. Amen. The poor have the gospel preach. I'm preaching to the poor out there. I'm talking about the poor in spirit. You might have a lot of money, but some poor in spirit. I, Lord, have us ain't got enough of word in and, and they've got some preachers that ain't giving enough word. Yeah. They're coming to their scripture and, and they think they're going to live off and they'll and they'll crumb. I've got to have a loaf. All right. The dead grave. Keep your loaf. Yeah. Make a good sense. Two or three. <laughs> And this is he who shall not be offended me. He said, he said don't tell John again. He got offended. John got offended because he was working for Jesus. Now he's about to lose his head. But you know, the scripture says that those that die for the Lord, amen, that's martyrs. John, John amen, he's going to be part, amen, of those martyrs, amen, that's going to not taste the second death. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, he get the reward here and don't even know it. Don't know it. Why not? He don't get ready to die. I'm Jesus. Seen him on the mount. All right, have a good Lord, little hands down for the ears. I say, God is awesome, God. Thank God for the word. Amen. Bless God. Lord, bless my own set there, Lord. So, we got here, we got uh, the blood had to be shed. Yeah. <coughs> when Jesus paid for it, for, for and he, the Lord, have mercy. He went uh, along. As he went along, he paid it. Things for us. That's what we want to learn this morning. Amen. At the Passover. Yeah. We want to find out what he did for us. We want to find out through the word of God what he did. As he long he went along the way. Uh, he paid for our our property. Amen. Let's go to uh, page Amen 12, 26, Luke 9 and 5, 57. Lord, Luke 9 and 57. That's going to be, Lord, have mercy, God. Yeah, help me so loud, Lord. I don't want to get drunk and I can't finish. You got to hear Herman. Amen. 9 and 57, page 12, 26. That's why I need to go, Lord, to see the air. I got to, yeah, help me so loud, Jesus. 9 and 57. Uh, and it came to pass that as they, Went in the way, a straight man said to him, Lord, I will follow thee whatsoever. Yes, it started at 55. 55? Okay, Brother Joe. I'm, I'm reading with you. But he tried to rebuke, he did what? Yeah. Oh, look at y'all. Now, why do you want me to start there when folks don't like rebuke? Is this a part of correction? Amen. Huh? Amen. Lord, they jumped on that today. They ain't no cross. Lord, that was the chief. That's good, little John. But he tried and rebuked him and said, You know not what manner of spirit you are. For the Son of Man is not come to destroy man's life, but to save them, and they went to a, another village. They were telling Jesus to call, call down fire like Elijah did. Yeah. That's what he was asking Jesus Christ to do. Yeah, and right. Jesus Christ had turned around and rebuked the disciples. Now, that's enough not to go back to church next Easter. <laughs> Not next Sunday, next Easter. Something just come on East. Yeah. Lord, I want to know. But we're going to put it in there. So, man, hey, man, let's come. Uh, yeah, yeah, he said, you know what? I, I didn't come to kill him. Now, where are you going? Hold up now. Yeah. I, I, I'll come to save him. That's right. This is how It came to pass, and they went in that in the way. A certain man said unto him, Lord, I will follow thee wherever thou go. And Jesus said unto him, Foxes have hold. Yeah. The bird of air has nests. Yeah. But the son of man had nowhere to lay his head. Yeah. Property had to be paid for. Yeah. I said, Jesus paid for it. He paid for our property. He came as a poor man. 
The scripture says so we can enjoy the rest of life. I got enough to tie that in. We're covering the second Corinthians. Amen. Second Corinthians, Lord, help us to God. Eight and nine. Amen. Second Corinthians, eight and nine. I'm going to give you some extra scripture, man, so the Lord gives it to me. I can't give you no more than what God gives to me. Now I got more about Easter than I did last Easter. Because yeah. he gave me more about Easter. I couldn't give you more about Easter last Easter because I didn't have it. Some preachers can't give you no more than what they got. That's all they got. Come here in 2 Corinthians 89. For you know the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, that though he was rich, yet for our sake he became poor, that through his poverty we might be what? So you can tie in that scripture just read. He said, if I can have whole, the burden that I have less. But the son of man ain't got no way to lay his head. I said, he ain't no way to lay his head. So he came to pay poverty for us. So we can come out of it. Amen. Amen. Lord, have mercy. I'm going out to the home. Everything you paid for. It's paid for. It's what I want to leave it in, in lay away for. Uh-uh. You know what people put in lay away? They got to leave it there until it's paid for. Yeah. Uh-uh. I ain't leaving that in the lab with. It's already paid. paid. You buy it at the store, you're going to take it with you. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? You buy it for what? At the store, you're going to take it with you. Yeah, you take it with you. Couldn't do what? Paid for. for. Go get what Jesus paid for. Find out what it is. It's yours. Amen. Get a little hand clap for you. That's good. Good, dog. Amen. You paid for it. I bought mine. I bought y'all. Amen. Bless God. Come with me now, amen, to uh, Matthew uh, 27 and 26, page 1075. Page 1075. That's a man. That's she here when I got here. It must be 11. Let's see. Matthew 27 and 26. I don't see it now. That's 12, 26. Page 1226. Yeah, that line Let me see if that'll line up. How oh, that ain't lining up. Let's see. You. Let's go to 27, 27. We're going to line it up. Matthew. Matthew 27, 20. Page 1176. Right. Page 1176. Uh, Lord, I don't know where I get them. Yes, yeah, ma'am. All right. So that page 1176 of uh, Matthew 27. Amen. 26. So, Brother Matthew, we're, we're over in your book now. <laughs> Lord have mercy. Uh, then released he barbers unto him, and, and when he had scourged Jesus, he delivered him to be what? Crucified. Crucified. So they had to be paid for. Crucifixion. That's, he, had, he had to pay for our sins. Yeah. He had to pay for our healing with his stripes. Yeah. Come with me. Come with me to Isaiah, through the third chapter, of page 882. Page 882. And we're going to see what's prophesied by Isaiah. So that had to be paid for. So Isaiah prophesied what we can have when Jesus was going to be crucified. Have you been crucified? Mm. Is it paid for? Yes, yes sir. Well, y'all go get it. It's yours. Who had to leave our report as a question? Where you at? Isaiah 53. Isaiah 53. chapter, the first verse, page 882. You there? I've been there. Okay, we're waiting. I'm going to jump. We don't mind waiting on you, brother. I've been there. Well, I believe our report as a question. Yeah. Page 882. Isaiah 53, chapter 1, verse. To whom is the arm of the Lord revealed? That's another question. All right. Who are you telling this to? Who have believed? So God has a report. Who else got a report? The man. Man, the doctor. You know, the, you know the doctor got a report on that? Yeah. He got a report on that. When you go to the doctor, he takes your x-ray and you look at it. He said, this is what's wrong with you. All right? Then the, the question is asking me, who report? I'm going to believe. I'm going to believe. So the Lord got a report. I said, okay, Lord. You got a report. The doctor got a report. I believe I'm going to go with God. your report. Yeah. Over... The doctor's report. Because the doctor may not be able to help me like you can. Because then they're going to say, well,
Well, this is all we can do for you. Well, Doc, goodbye. That's <laughs> <laughs> all you can do. Goodbye. Goodbye, Doc. That's all you can do. I know somebody can do more. Because mm -hmm. I got the report. And I believe his report. Mm -hmm. You got the person that told you that by his stripes you were healed. Yeah. Ozzie, you're moving too fast. Uh -huh. <laughs> I'll score <slip> that. <laughs> but I love it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she can't help herself. She's saying so nice. Okay, I'm so nice. <laughs> hey, praise the Lord. Give him a hand, clap, Second part, for he shall grow up before him as a tender plant, as a root out of a dry ground. He had no form of commerce, we shall see him. There had no beauty, and we should desire him. When he went to the cross, there ain't no beauty. They, they put him in his beer. Amen. Lord, Lord, how about say? They whipped him uh, with, uh, on his back. Lord, how about that? Blood everywhere. Lord, how much of Jesus? Put a crown of thorns on his head. Blood coming out. Lord, how much of Jesus? Blood was all over the place when, you, when Jesus Christ was being crucified. Amen. Bless God. So the scripture tells me. Amen. Bless God. He had no form of crown. to see him. There yeah, was no beauty. He was disfigured. Through crucifixion. He's a spy, third word. A rejected a man, a man rejected him. A man of sorrows, Lord, how much that? And acquainted with grief. And we hid with our faces from him. He despised, we him not. When my mother died, and then bless God, the grief spirit came on me. And then for my mother, and the word of God came in me and, and told me that Jesus paid for my grief and sorrow. And in a preacher chair, you just go and cry. Tell that preacher, no, I got Jesus prepared for my grief. And sorrows. I ain't crying. Not me. I can't bring them back. That's right. Would I need a grief spirit to come on me and take me out of here? Most people get a grief spirit on them. I'm the, I'm the things are strong. They're a kid. Yeah, I know some people die. Yeah. When they wife, a man, a man wife died, there was nothing wrong with the man. Good hell. He was in good hell. There was nothing wrong with him. And when his wife died, a grief spirit came on. And the next week, it was bearing in. That didn't take long. Y'all yeah. play around with that stuff. I got a report. I believe who report? I believe the Lord's report. Oh, well, man. Mm -hmm. That's what I mean. That's what faced it, man, from him. And he was despised, and he steamed him not. Because surely, we got a fourth verse. Surely, he had borne our grief. And what? Carried he off. carried our sorrow. I don't need to carry him. I said, I don't need a cab. Hey, Amen. When you bring your sorrows to me, I'm taking it to, to Jesus. <laughs> I'm not carrying your sorrows and your grief and telling me all that stuff that happened to you. All right, I'm going to take it up. Jesus. Jesus. Keep your trash can clean. Jesus can have it better than I can. Yes, he can. What did you say, Brother John? Keep your what? Trash can. I bet people put stuff in. <laughs> you want to help me with it, Brother John? Yeah, you help me. I'm yeah. going to give it to Jesus. You don't carry it with you. There you go. And then they give it to Jesus. Give it to who? Give it to Jesus. Help them yeah. out. Don't, don't try to carry the stuff that people be carrying around. Surely that boy, I grieve and sorrow. Amen. We see them in the strip of God. Who, 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 who did it? God. God did it to his own son. Yeah. Sometimes when I read that, I'll start crying. Yeah. And what Jesus Christ has done for me, I take that person. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. His father did this to his own son. For me, you put your name there. You want to? Yeah. It's personal. Yes, sir. Lord, have mercy on you. See, God, you somebody. You did that in your own son. How many people would do that to their own child? Ain't nobody in here. Smitten of God and afflicted. Fifth word, but he was wounded for our transgression. Mm -hmm. but he was, why he was wounded? Because well, I, was Cause I did something wrong. Mm -hmm. I sinned against God. Mm -hmm. Sin had to be paid for on the cross. That's why when, when Jesus Christ was taking the sin of the world on the cross, the scripture says, my God, my God, why hast thou forsaken me? I don't know how people think God's going to be with them in their sins. 
when he left his son. God is holy. He cannot stand to be around sin. So that's why his son is son to clean us up. So we can be in his presence. Thank you, Lord. His blood that was shed brought us brought the shoe back. The Bible says we were redeemed by the blood of the Lamb. Angels cannot be redeemed. That's why them fallen angels don't like us. The devil don't like us. Because they can't be redeemed and sin against God. And so they were thrown out of heaven. Oh, that mercy of Jesus. And they don't like us because we can be redeemed. redeemed. That's right. By the blood. Thank you, by the cross. Thank you, Lord. By the Passover. Easter. Wounded by our trying to and bruised for our iniquity. He did it for us. Yeah. The chastisement of our peace was a part of him. He was chastised for give us peace. He called a whooping for us. He called a whooping for us. He was chastised so we can have peace. Mm-hmm. Paid for. Yes, sir. You better find out what's paid for at the cross Thank on you. Easter. Go get it. On the resurrection. Yeah. Find out what God done for you. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Child's out of our peace was upon him. And with his what? Stripes. He received him strife for our healing. Lord, have mercy, Jesus. He suffered. So we can go free. Thank you, Lord. Lord, have mercy, Jesus. Couldn't do it myself. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Give the Lord a hand clap for we did done for us. He's an awesome God. His son is awesome. Lord, have mercy, Jesus. Lord, have mercy, God. Come with me now, sir. You got to read, sir. Say what? You got to read a little more. You want some more? Yeah. I'll right, give you some more. Because I got some extra groceries for you in there. Come on. All we are sheep have gone what? We're all went astray. You don't put one to stay astray. You better not stay astray. He's trying to get you back in. Don't stay astray. He paid there so you want to stay that way. Mm-hmm. We have tried every one to his own way, and the Lord had led on him the iniquity of us all. For everybody. Everybody. It's for everybody. Everybody. All the way you're exempt because you don't want it. That's it. Yeah. He was oppressed, and he was afflicted. Yet he opened what? Not a mother. Boy, it would been us, boy. We, Lord, we call him fire down. <laughs> call him fire down from where? That's from heaven. Right. Get him, Lord. That's right. When he opened, Not that is right. he was brought as a lamb to the slaughter. As a sheep before the shares is dumb. So he opened out his mouth. He was taken from prison, from judgment. Who shall declare his generation? For he is cut off out of the land of the living. For the transgressions of my people was he stricken. Lord, have mercy. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Yeah. And, he, and he made his grave with the wicked. Mm. He made his grave with the wicked. The wicked. He went down in hell. That's right. Mm. That's right. For three days. Right. And Peter said he went and preached to the spirits. That died in the time of Noah. Thank you. Because only eight souls were saved. Jesus went down and preached to them and gave them another chance. Thank How many took that chance? I don't know. Yeah. But I sure wouldn't want to be with that group that did. Yeah. Thank you, Lord. Lord, how much did hell keep them there? No. no. He threw off the scripture said. Why he was in hell. Can you imagine that you go down? Can you imagine you go down in hell and all the demons jump you? All the running men and all the devils co-hosts jump you? Lord, the Bible says he threw them off. He threw all his powers and powers and made a show of them openly. Lord, that's enough. Amen. Not to want to fool with Jesus again. <laughs> Just a lamb. All right. He a tough lamb. Lion. Real tough. Lion of Judah. 
He's a liar to what? And God hold a, a lion. Yes, he thought he was just a lamb. Yep. And he flew around and grabbed a lion by the tail. Yep. And Jesus put something on him. Yes, he did. Open. Well, I don't believe they went and told that either. But we got dressed it. We going to tell it. But wait now. Says that thing with y'all. Because he had done no violence, neither was any deceit in his mouth. What is deceit? He didn't lie. He didn't lie. He told the truth. So he went to hell with the armor of God. Uh huh. He went to hell with the armor of God. The whole armor of God. Yeah, so we can fight the spirits all. They don't want to say. Yeah, sometimes the devil might be good to say, but he wants to stay safe. Another deception. We're going to teach you how to stay safe over here. Since so, so the guy said, you can't get it on, so the whole one on. <laughs> Don't just put on all, half an armor. If the devil's going to shoot that gun somewhere where you ain't got no armor, get it all on. So you can whip him. And then whip him for me too while you whip him. Going to get Yet it pleased the Lord to bruise him, yet he put him to grief. When he, uh, thou shalt see him, his soul and offering of sin. He shall see his seed. It shall belong his day, for the pleasure of the Lord shall prosper in his hand. Lord, have mercy, God. I, Lord, if the Lord prosper in his hand, did he stand in red? No. No, he said, all power in heaven and of heaven and earth been given to me. Who gave it to me? God did. I said he was obedient. And when you're obedient to God, he gives you things. Yes, sir. When you disobey God, he'll give a fish eye. He takes that from you. You ain't going to want me to take it. They say, God, give me a you don't take it. That ain't any truth. You know what they called it. You got to get it. He say? gave Saul. He gave Saul his anointing. Yeah. And then the scripture said, he put an evil spirit on Saul. What happened to the anointing? Gone. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's gone then. No. So few people think you're going to keep it. Oh, what happens? What do you say, Brother Charles? You come back to the place of office, sir. Yeah, the house was clean. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they got, just got saved. They get nothing else in that house. Get something in your house. Pretty Listen, Brother Charles, get, go put something in your house. Something in there. Where we at now? We, just, we should be at 11. Thank you, Brother Charles. He shall see uh, of the travel of his soul. He shall be satisfied. By his knowledge shall righteous servants justify many, he shall bear their iniquity. So he's going to teach us. Amen. He's going to teach us his word. Jesus is a teacher. Amen. Amen. He's the anointed one. He'll teach us. Amen. Bless God. About Easter. About the Passover. Yeah. So we can have knowledge of what he did for us on that day. Lord, have mercy, Jesus. Forever. Therefore, when I divide him in portion with the great, I wonder he won't divide it with the weak. And he should divide the strong with the who? Strong. Why he don't divide the strong with the strong? It is yeah. <laughs> yeah, He will divide it with the strong. I'll throw something at you. I'll see that. I'll go another way. So I said, okay, then, Lord, in my spiritual exercise, I said, Lord, I'm strong in the Lord. Yeah. In the power yeah. of his might. He said, let the weak say. I'm strong. So when I get weak, Along the way, yeah. I said, I'm strong in the Lord and the power of his mind. I said, okay, Lord, you say you're going to let, where you got this fall from? He took it from the devil. He took everything back. Yeah. Adam lost it in the garden. The second Adam, the Bible said the second Adam, Jesus. I said, Jesus is the second Adam. I said, the second Adam came, Lord, have mercy God, and took everything back. Then he turned around and said, I'm going to take the spoil. And then when I took from that devil, I'm going to give it to those that's strong in me. Thank you, Lord. Lord, have mercy, Thank Jesus. You, Lord. Hallelujah. Lord, have mercy, Jesus. I'm going to divide it with him. Yeah, you're going to give a piece of it. Lord, Jesus. Because he had poured out his soul in the death. He was numbered with the transgression. He bared the sins of many. And made intercession for the what? 
transgressions. Ain't but one mediator between man and God. I'm talking to all the people out there. I said, ain't but one mediator between man and God. That's Christ Jesus. He said, he's making an intercession for us. Eh? He's praying for us. Lord, pray for these. You know, the Bible says to set them off. And we'll stop sinning. Eh? Lord, help us, God. Eh? Down here on this earth, Lord. Eh? And we don't let no demon and devil eh? try to destroy us, Lord. Or something you already paid for. Eh? On Easter Sunday, you rose and then the third day. Eh? Bless God eh? with all power. With all power in your hand, Lord. Yeah. Lord, Lord, your word said, your word said, with two or three, with two or three, touching the grand, touching the grand, in that, in your name.